London. The East West Writer. Last week it reasoned to me. The English government might be a crook. You're second to the last prime minister, a war criminal. Your mass media, most of them, in cahoots with the government. Together, they fabricate enemies, spurn terror, and spread fear. Divide and conquer. The Economist is in charge of inciting animosity and hatred on a global scale. It is lawless. To you it brags it is free. Free to do what? Free to cover the sky with the crimes of our enemies, until blood drips on our children. Our own crimes? Hug or mugged. The Economist tells us what to think, whom to go to war with and whom to vote for. Sovereign Britain is bad. Russia and China are bad. Donald Trump is so, so bad. There are now tens of thousands of websites and blogs dedicated to The Economist's desperate agit prop. The reality is, the people don't trust The Economist. They read it as a matter of self-preservation. What is the propaganda racket up to next? We think you are criminals, in cahoot with the corrupt elites. We think you are in cahoot with the criminals that run America and terrorize the world. You are the media mafia. And one day our historians will set you straight.